doing Scrubs one year, the head of Disney Studios called up and said, uh, uh, hey, Courtney Cox, Bill, you wrote the first year of Friends. She wants to do a comedy again. You want to do it? And uh, just not for any other reason than most comedy writers and comedians, so I think, are inherently lazy. I said, not really. And, uh, and it became a joke in the writer's room because the way network television works, uh, I had just tried to get a really personal show of my own soul and couldn't do it. And uh, I said, you know what sucks? I could go into uh, um, the network president at the time. I won't use any names. It rhymes with uh, G. Reed McPherson. Reed McNerson. Yeah. <laughs> Steve McPherson. All right. Yeah, that, that joke would crush in Hollywood. Um, the, uh, I said I could go in and uh, say, uh, uh, I want to do a show about Courtney Cox getting divorced in her 40s, and she's going to go date young guys and call it Cougar Town which is a lame joke, and I'd never have to say anything else, and they'd put it on TV. And that became like a room bit in the room. We would, right. we'd say, well, between the scenes, you'd have Cougar Claw, like, rip the screen apart. Wow! <laughs> wow! It was, it was like, I think you're a handsome young man. Wow! <laughs> we, uh, we did that joke for about a month, yeah. and then uh, uh, I said, uh, should, should we do this? Like and show. Kevin said, uh, Kevin being a young, ambitious writer, he should have said, I'll do it. I don't think I'll do anything. Yeah. And uh, uh, we, 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 went, on the air, let's try it. we went to Steve McPherson and I said uh, that exact sentence and he said, uh, all right, we'll pick that up. Yeah. <laughs> it was a 100% true story. <laughs> and then here's the nightmare of it. Then Kevin and I went back and to a restaurant. We're like, well, what do we do now? <laughs> <laughs> it was the yeah, it was, it was, it was, even a room full of executives and Bill said the name of the show is Cougar Town. And literally his eyes lit up and he goes, ooh, I can sell that. Yeah, and it's like, okay, guess what I'm here. But part of the fun of the creative process is, uh, you know, we thought it would be maybe a campy show like Ab Fab that she dates young guys. And we, we tried to write that, it was horrible. Anybody see the first four episodes of the show? See, there's no plot. That's it. Trolling victims. I know, right? And then we, uh, we brought all the writers together and said, uh, uh, you know, it's really hard to change course on a TV show nowadays and said, what's this show really about? What's a, what would be a show that we would want to write and, and uh, want to see these guys with? The ensemble was great. And we came up with the idea, there was a show about adult friendship and how you while away the time in your 40s and there's a group of people that they'd all be very lonely working up for each other. And uh, uh, it overnight became a show about essentially drinking wine and hanging out. And, uh, and now it went from being a joke to a show that we're all really passionate about and proud of. We still hate the title, but whatever. Still, sure. You're still the worst title in television history. <laughs>